what's up turbo fam we are back with yet another video if y'all would like to see how i made this delicious salmon and rice bowl please make sure y'all stay tuned also don't forget to like comment subscribe and hit that notification bell so y'all can be notified every time we drop new videos It's your girl Turbo Tip back with another video. If you are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. We hope you consider subscribing to the channel before you decide to leave. If you are returning, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining us for yet another video. Um, today, we are going to be making a salmon rice bowl. So I'm gonna show y'all all the ingredients that I'll be using and then I'll pretty much turn the, food over, turn the camera over to the food so y'all can see how I put everything together. So here are the ingredients we'll be using y'all. We got some salmon soy sauce two mangoes two jalapenos plant-based butter some lemon pepper and seafood seasoning some sriracha an english cucumber garlic ginger just some boiling the bag brown rice and some sazon what's up fam so today i'll be doing a voiceover for this video right here y'all just see me seasoning the salmon with the seasonings i showed y'all in the previous clip we got some lemon pepper some sazon and some seafood seasoning by red lobster we also added some olive oil just to bring everything together y'all y'all see me rubbing that salmon making sure everything is everything making sure i get the seasoning all up in that salmon's flesh okay if y'all don't see the seasoning y'all ain't got enough so I'm going to come back through again and add some more seasoning, y'all. Okay. Then I'm going to rub it in some more. Don't be scared to touch your salmon, okay? Right here, I just got some jalapenos. If y'all don't like spice, y'all can always take the seeds out of the jalapenos. Or y'all can just omit the jalapenos and use um, pepperoncinis. But in my opinion, the recipe will not taste the same with no pepperoncinis. Y'all need this spice. And I like spice, so it's good with me. Also, do not add pickled jalapenos. Y'all will mess up this whole recipe and I'm going to be mad at y'all, okay? <laughs> so don't add the pickle. Use fresh. Right here, y'all see me just cutting up the mango. Listen, the reason why y'all don't see me peeling this mango because this mango gave me such a hard time. But one, is not ripe to its, you know, capacity. It's not ripe the way I want it to be ripe. So it, it, it just gave me a hard time, y'all. It was a real struggle. But, you know, I got it together. I made do. And I, I was able to cut it up. And I was so happy to see that I was, um, see the uh, mango when I went inside of Costco, y'all. Because I've been missing mango. Like, seriously, I love some mango. Y'all see how good and fresh it looks. Oh, my God. Mm. Listen, come through, mango. Okay, there go jalapenos. I see you, jalapenos. I ain't leaving you out. Y'all. Y'all see that salmon, right? Okay, <laughs> like I said, if y'all can't see that seasoning, it ain't seasoned right. Right here, I'm just putting the butter in my pan because I'm about to do um, a little bit of garlic, ginger, butter mixture type going on. I added a little bit of olive oil to make sure that the butter doesn't burn, y'all. And then there go my um, garlic. With this garlic, y'all got to be careful. Y'all want to make sure y'all moving it around in y'all pan. Y'all want to make sure y'all not burning it. As y'all can see, I got my... Uh, my stove up too high so i end up turning it down some y'all <laughs> but i ain't burned the garlic so that's all that matters like you know that's all that matters i added some ginger that's what i'm doing right here y'all don't skip the ginger in this recipe because it really brings um that rice together for real and we're not doing too much with the rice because as y'all seen that salmon already got enough seasoning for the rice for the mango for the jalapenos for the cucumbers like Everybody going to get some of that um, seasoning off that salmon, okay? As y'all can see, I overcooked the brown rice purposely because I don't want no gummy brown rice. And to me, you have to cook that brown rice just a tad bit longer in order for it to taste 
you know, tastes like something. And that's what I prefer. I'm adding some soy sauce to this. And I'm adding just a little bit of the seafood seasoning. Okay. Now let's assemble this bowl. My favorite part, y'all. Y'all see that salmon, right? Oh, okay. I thought y'all ain't see it. <laughs> but nah, um, that salmon was good, y'all. This whole little ordeal was just amazing. It was really good. So make sure y'all try this recipe out. And let's come in with the jalapenos because I like it spicy. I'm coming through just sitting the jalapenos now. Y'all, I try to make it look like something. Make it aesthetically pleasing for y'all. You know, I don't know if I did a good job or not, but I tried. That's all that matters. Can I get an A for effort? Okay. I got five. Yep, got five jalapenos on there. And then I'm going to come through with the mango. Y'all, I love mango. I really do. This mango wasn't, like I said, as ripe as it should have been, but it served its purpose for this recipe because it was bomb. And y'all don't have to add as much mango as I did. I just, like I said, like mango. So, yeah. And this just looks so pretty, y'all. How can y'all not want to try this recipe? And look, see how long this video is? Like, this recipe was so easy. It was so easy, y'all. Cucumber. Y'all want that cucumber for that, you know, that fresh taste, that freshness. It kind of balanced off the jalapenos and the um, sriracha. So it all comes together just, just the way it's supposed to. Here I come with that sriracha. I had to slow it up for y'all so y'all can see that. Ooh, okay, sriracha come through. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. I'm going to say it again because I don't feel like y'all heard me. Y'all, this was so good. Like, it was so good. So I really hope y'all try this recipe out. If y'all do, comment down below. Let us know how it turned out. Let us know if y'all enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed it. Um, like I said, if y'all new here, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel if y'all returning thank y'all so much for coming back for another video like it means so much to us we say it all the time but it means so much to us just the just the thought of knowing that people actually come you know come check out the video see what we got going on it means the most it means everything to us so thank y'all so much make sure y'all comment subscribe hit the notification bell and thank y'all again see y'all in the next one